We done came a long way, now it's Creek Squad, Creek Squad, dirty white boys from one lane road, south side going too hard, ain't seen nothing like us, not even up on the telly, dog. We come out, shock your motherfuckers like we got kind of prod. Yeah, I'm fucking ugly, yeah, I'm slightly overweight, yeah, I got a bunch of goons that are coming right your place. Yeah, I live out in the country, yeah, I like being that redneck, sun burn skin, still cold around my damn neck. Riding around in trucks that was fresh back in the 80s, fully loaded when I'm rolling, National City on a daily. Cause you crack at motherfuckers, can get lit up, I ain't playing, I ain't bothering. See you back here again with Bubba Gump. Reviewing video two, which is the new Grizzly Wintergreen pouches. That new can design though looks pretty sick, if you know what I mean. I can explain why it's cracked already because when I went to the store, I literally had no fucking dip. <laughs> and I needed to dip bad because it was a bad day and I was trying to keep it for like a review, but I couldn't help it but Take you one two, stick her in and Grizzly. Well, I probably already reviewed a Grizzly Wintergreen pouch, but I figured go ahead and review the new can. So review the pouches and flavoring and all that. How many did you put in? I put in two. Upper decker, make your pack bigger. <laughs> Upper decker, make your packer bigger. Now mm. make sure that can's but lids on like straight. That way it looks cooler. Mm. Now, um, like I said in the last video, I lost the spare, the mud jug, so that's why we're using the bottles here. My you can't bad. be doing that anymore. Hey, wait until I buy another one. <laughs> but, um, we know my name, though. Alright, we're back. Doc, I thought my grandmother was coming back inside, but if, if you see a random pause and then Re readjustment around out of nowhere you know what happened <laughs> it's been about three minutes now um how's the flavoring to you i mean pouches on the grizzly i hate to say it cope skull don't really have like no. the winter green flavor of the long cut to me grizzly has a better stronger nicotine than any other chew i I've been chewing Grizzly for almost six years now. I went from Copenhagen straight to Grizzly, and it's it's, it's always been there for me whenever Grizzly. I needed it. Yep. Plus, it's cheaper. It's cheaper and than better, Copenhagen. Better and stronger. Better. They give you more. They actually know what the <laughs> heck they're doing. Mhm. Mm and they're not assholes that try to terminate a fucking channel. Nope. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Also. I'm making phone cases for merch. I already have a couple designs up. Just send me a little message. I'll leave a couple contact infos where you can get a hold of me, like my Facebook page or my Snapchat or my Instagram. Get a hold of me through there and call it good. I'll screen. I'll send you the pictures of what I got for case designs, and we'll go from there. Also, gotta let me know what kind of phone you got, so that way I can work around, see where I can get the case for that certain phone and all that. And yeah, if you ain't got the right phone, it ain't gonna work. Mm -mm. I found that out the hard way. Yeah, <laughs> we all have. Yeah. Now, um, this wintergreen pouch surprisingly actually has a wintergreen taste. I didn't think it would have a wintergreen taste. Like, most wintergreen pouches don't have a wintergreen taste. They have, like, a weird Pepto-Bismol taste. Yeah, just a little bit. Like, skulls. Long cut in <laughs> general. <laughs> yeah. Skulls just trash. <laughs> Never liked skull. I, I did because, well, school, the Swedish one. Mm -hmm. So, the Swedish one, I'll give credit, but... Um, yeah, because the, it actually had a better mint taste. The reason why I do the Skull Snooze, because it's actually Swedish and not actually the American one, yep. so I'll go with that. Yeah. But if it's the American... <laughs> um, oh yeah, I have another question for you. What's that? I'm ordering another can of Siberia Red, a can of Siberia Blue, and a can of Siberia Brown. You're going to be up to try them. 
one after another, probably not, because I'll probably be screwed up. But yeah. I'll no, be I down. mean we'll like record a video and then maybe wait a day, record the next hour where we're not completely like <laughs> like I was on my Siberia video. Uh, yeah. But um. We are back. Bubba Gun's back. Now, the wintergreen flavor is actually burning. Just a little bit. Then again, Upper Dacker. Y'all look sexy yet? <laughs> <laughs> well, I do like the new design, what they're doing here, because um, outdoor courts, hmm. if you can see focus. Don't focus on his pretty face. Just I'll get out of it. I'm just kidding. But it looks kind of... This kind of looks like a fish scale. Kind of does. Um, I was... When I first saw some of the other cans, like the mint and the normal winter green long cuts, it actually looked like a barbecue grill. It actually did. Hmm. But now that I'm looking closer at the can, if you realize, it actually looks like fish scales. Yeah, it kind of does look like fish scales. I don't know if you guys see that that well, but fish scales. And, uh oh, screen just went dark. Oh, five percent. Camera is at five percent. So, what would you have to rate? Surprisingly, this pouch is pretty good. So, what would you have to rate this Warner Green pouch? I'd have to give it a five, just because I, I don't really choose pouches i like june grain push pouch push pouch push pouch power hour <laughs> <laughs> now i'll admit i chewed i had some pouches in my life but not that kind of sick fuckers not <laughs> not the little no i'm not actually talking about the dead pouches but uh, we might want to hear that i'll scratch that <laughs> now i'd have to give don't, it don't listen to him <laughs> <laughs> might have to give it about a seven out of all the winter green pouches I had, this is probably the best winter green pouch I had. Now the mint pouch, I'd have to give it to Skull Snooze as much as I hate to. Yeah. I can't real, I can't stand the Grizzly Mint pouches. I never tried the Grizzly Mint pouches. Don't, I, don't I, <laughs> trust me when I tell you. But um, other than that, pretty good. It tastes pretty good. Mm-hmm. Well, also, by the third video, expect a new intro. If not this video, but I'm just saying. Maybe, maybe not. Never know. Well, this Sea Dog, catch you on the flip side. And that's. See ya.